When the video of Paul Pogba and Jose Mourinho meeting in training was released the day after Manchester United's defeat to Derby, it all kicked off. You know, Pogba was stripped of his vice captaincy from Jose Mourinho. Mourinho confirmed that. Was this pure evidence of their disdain towards each other, the fact that Pogba doesn't like Mourinho? No one really knew. And what was Mourinho actually saying to Pogba to cause such a reaction? Now, their conversation was all in relation to a video that Paul Pogba released on Instagram from Old Trafford during a derby game. If you haven't seen the video, here it is. Hey, you want to smile? Why, why is this smile? Why? Harmless in itself, nothing wrong with that. A player uploading a video, it's pretty standard these days on social media. But the video was the cause of the problem. Before I explain exactly why that is the case, here's the video with cleaned up audio, thanks to a couple of guys on Reddit, shout out to you two, and also with some transcriptions of what Popper and Mourinho were actually saying. Now, as you can see from the video, Mourinho's frustration is all based around the fact that he thought this video from Pogba went up after full time, after Man United had lost on penalties and after Man United had been knocked out of the League Cup by a derby. That's why he's pissed off. But Pogba didn't. That's exactly why Mourinho called in the press officer, John Allen, and asked him, what, did he post this after the game? Pogba didn't do this. Now, this is where the confusion is. Because if you've ever been to Old Trafford, the signal there is absolutely atrocious on 3G, 4G. You hardly get anything. And even the Wi-Fi, if you can somehow get onto the Wi-Fi, that's sketchy in itself. Now, this video from Paul Pogba, it went up after the full-time whistle, but it wasn't recorded after the full-time whistle. And that is where the issue is laid. That's why Pogba looks so confused at what Jose Mourinho is saying. And that is why Mourinho is so incensed, because he would consider this obviously disrespectful if it did get recorded after full time and it was uploaded after full time. That is where the confusion is and that is why Pogba looks so perplexed and why Mourinho is so pissed off. That's what caused the frosty meeting between the pair. It wasn't anything to do with their relationship other than the fact that it was this video that caused it. And now that Pogba has explained exactly what went on and the press officer would have explained it as well, there shouldn't be any more of an issue from this. And I do expect Paul Popper to start for Manchester United against West Ham this weekend. But their relationship, it is tetchy. And it has been tetchy for a while. If you didn't see it, I released a full story video on the Popper and Mourinho relationship going the whole way back to August 2016 when Paul Popper joined Manchester United again, right through to September 2018 to the current situation we find ourselves in. That explains it in far more detail than this video, which has been blown out of proportion, will. Now, while this video did look awful, it seems nothing more than a misunderstanding, but it's indicative of Pogba and Mourinho's relationship, how it's on the edge and how it really is tetchy between the two. But for the video itself and the frosty meeting at training, it was nothing more than a misunderstanding.